We've come to help you set up. Yeah. What do you want us to do? Oh, great. Uh, well, this table here needs to go there so I can stick all the drinks and the canapes on it. Yeah. Oh, and there's some uh, decorations in the kitchen that need to go out. And I've got some signs that need to stick outside to say it will close for the evening. Oh, and there's some disposable cameras there behind Jay. Need to go on all the tables. You're so organised. Well, I'll, uh, I'll wait to start the decorations. Cheers. All right, I'm going to uh, make a start on the canapes. Anybody wants me? I'll be in there. Have you spoken to me? I wasn't going to miss my granddaughter's big moment. Oh, the opportunity to see the changed man in the flesh. I have prisons done wonders for you, Max. Thank you. A lot of money in property, I take it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing all right. So that Josh, is he your boss? No. No, we work in different departments. He's very young and handsome. Is that why you don't like him? You're right, darling. No, I need to find my own. Please don't go. I just to sort it out tomorrow when you've calmed down. Right, everyone's here for you. This is your night, isn't it? Well, someone should have told her that. Well, I've got you have a present here. The Harry Potter play you wanted to see. It's tickets. I thought it was all sold out. Oh, it is. You know, I've pulled some straight. Thank you, Dad. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, was Josh still there? Uh, no. No, he's gone. On his own? I didn't see it, darling. Well, I need to go and find him. Abs, please. Look, everyone's here for you. Forget him. I never trust a man who turns up for a birthday party in a suit. Anyway. Abs, we need you to leave the macarena. Come on. <laughs> This isn't the, uh... Yeah. Sorry, we're bailing early, but we've got to get them up for the party. Vouchers, yes, yeah, tickets. Some people would think Abby was a lucky girl. Well, you know different, do you? What those girls need from you is affection, attention, honesty, not some grand gesture. Throwing money at someone don't represent love. It's a lazy way of pretending that you care. I wouldn't take this the wrong way, Cora, but I don't think I'm going to take parenting advice from you. Now it's rainy these days. When's the last time Tanya actually spoke to you? Maybe you could learn from my mistakes. You know, if you've changed, Cora, why do you find it so hard to believe that I might have? Because I can see right through you, Max. The outside might be shiny and new, but on the inside, you're the same rotten liar and cheat you always were. I don't know what you're playing at, but what I do know is those girls will end up as collateral damage again. 